Hello everybody and welcome to your Mansfield's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this is a reading for the 15th of August 2020 and it is for the sign of Leo. That being said, this here is a general reading, uh, so it's not going to correlate, it's not going to resonate with everybody, so please do take whatever resonates with you and leave the rest aside. If ever you feel like it, you, there are parts that do fit, do take whatever does and what doesn't, just leave it aside. It's a general reading, so it's normal that it's not going to resonate with everybody. However, if you would like to have some clarity, you would like to have some guidance on your personal uh, relationship, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com. You can also contact me and find the information right in the YouTube drop box right below this video. You will have the different types of readings that I offer, the price list, and you also have the contact information. So that being said, please do review that. And if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, please take a brief moment to click on the subscribe button to show your support, show your um, encouragement to the channel and to myself. And I would be eternally grateful. And without, uh, actually, no, I want to say also, please do stay tuned. Tomorrow is going to be your weekly, um, your weekly readings. You're also going to have, of course, your daily snapshots. And maybe even an extra reading. I'll, I'll, I'll see if I have time. Um, so that being said, this is um, this is the reading. What we want to know here is, um, are they going to leave their partner for you? So let's go see. I have the Queen of Swords in reverse. I have the Two of Pentacles. I have the King of Swords. And I have the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Let's keep her in reverse here, okay? This is you, and you are not happy. Uh, this is being indecisive. This is scattered. This is just not thinking clearly, okay? This is not talking. I'd have to say even that there's a cold shoulder that's going on right now. Um, this is all because, of course, you know, when you're in these type of relationships, they always say, you know, oh, we're going to do this. We're going to do that. That is going to happen. They make you the most beautiful promises. They create you some illusions and you believe in them. And you know what? Sometimes they're true, but sometimes they're not. And, um, you know, this is really, really frustrating. Nothing seems to be going forward in this relationship that you're in. It just seems to be like a cycle that keeps going over and over and over again. And this is you. You've had enough of it. You don't want any more of this. You just want this partner or you, you know, you just want to get out of it is what's going on so this is really about you though trying to prepare it's you though ready for battle it's you um in um in a state, I would say, that's almost cruel, okay, vengeful. Um, so this is where you are right now. You're trying to see through this. You're trying to get your answer. But if you're, if the answer does not uh, agree with you, you're ready for, um, for some vengeance is what I'm seeing here. Um, I do have over here the partner in question. And this is the partner who's having a lot of troubles juggling all these relationships that are going on. So much that we're becoming quite un stable. We don't know if we're going to fall down or not. There's just too much information. There's too much going around. They don't have the time for this. They do not have the patience. They just do not want it. They want a relationship, but they want a relationship of convenience, really just being convenience and nothing else. No strings attached. They don't want to have to leave their current partner. They just don't have what they want with their partner right now. And this is why they're coming to see um, to see you and to see other people. And to do so, they're very dishonest. They are trying to feed you a bunch of lies and illusions. So this is a very dishonest um, person that you're dealing with. And they are going to end up dropping one of these relationships because they're not able to handle two of them. That being said, this is going to drop. It is going to be Humpty Dumpty here. Humpty Dumpty falls off that wall. He breaks down in a million pieces and nobody can put him back up together. This is basically what the uh, partner is going to be doing to the relationship. Unfortunately, um, this is really about um, being indecisive. It's bad decisions. It's really about taking a fall in the relationship. Um, it's being dishonest but very clever this king of swords is a very clever individual they are cruel though they're cold they're without feeling they lie they're controlling they're hurtful they can even be verbally abusive i do have to say so you know this is all about being power hungry and getting exactly what it is that you want so this is about a relationship sadly for you that has fallen to pieces and just you know cannot be put back together that being said, I do have the card here, and, and this is a card that is telling me that the 
um, other person on the other side, so the original partner, is aware that this is going on and this is why this is going to have to end and this is going to end um, at this moment because they found out. So this is all about, uh, and they, they have very bad intentions towards you. They do not like you at all, not at all. They could go around and spread some gossip about you. They do not like you. They do not want your best interest. They just want you out of the picture. So be very, very careful about that. Don't be too no nosy. If, you know, they, they do break up with you, don't you just let it be because this person here in the relationship is not going to be very nice and they're not going to let this go very easily. So that being said, this does uh, conclude this reading. So unfortunately, they're going to stay with their original partner. If you do have any questions, you would like some clarity, some guidance on your situation, your um, your relationship, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com. Please don't forget to subscribe um, and stay tuned tomorrow for the weeklies, the snapshot. Um, so have a great day, much courage, and thank you for being there.